All right, you guys, welcome to class. My name is Teacher Chad, and this hour <clears throat> we are going to be uh, practicing our uh, uh, reading and pronunciation. Um, this is a class for uh, beginning and intermediate students. Uh, I do apologize for my tardiness, um, but I did want to uh, finish up my uh, my last class and uh, make sure everyone got, got a chance to read. Um, so uh, this hour we will be reading through four short stories. Uh, we may not get through all of them, but uh, we are uh, uh, definitely going to uh, try. Okay. Uh, the first story we'll be reading is uh, in the chat box right now. It's entitled Kelly's Gym Class. Okay. I put it in uh, both chat boxes for you. Okay. Very good. Let's uh, check and see who we got. Uh, Stephen, welcome back. How you doing? Hey, Shadow. I'm fine. How about you? I'm doing great. Good to see you again. Yeah. All right, Olga. Hi, Olga. Hi, hi teacher. Hi there. Uh, let's see, uh, Julian. Welcome. Okay, let's uh, let's check. Uh, let's see, Amparo. Hello. Hi there. How you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. Awesome, awesome. Uh, how about uh, Fausto? How you doing, Fausto? Okay, uh, let's see, Giovanni, how are you? I'm fine. How about you, Chad? I'm doing good. I'm doing really well. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Let me try Julian one more time. Julian, can you hear me okay? All right, probably still loading. Uh, Fausto, are you still loading? No, teacher. No, there you are. How you doing? Uh, great, and you, teacher? I'm doing okay. I've got bugs flying around all over the place, though. <laughs> I left my uh, my window over here open, and and uh, because uh, the, I guess this is the brightest light or something, they're all coming all over, and I'm swatting them from my uh, my screen. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Very cool. Let's see, Laszlo, welcome, uh, welcome to class. Hi, Chad. Hi, Chad. Nice to see you again. Hi there, good to have you here. Uh, and let's try Amparo one more time. Hi there. Yeah. All right, it's working. Very good. I can hear you. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> okay, and let's uh, let's check uh, Julian. Can you hear me? Yep, I can hear you now. Okay, it's probably my connection is bad. <laughs> That's okay. It uh, it it uh, happens to me all the time. Yeah. All right. Okay, you guys. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's an eternal problem. Uh, very good. Let's uh, let's uh, go ahead and get started. the The link is in your chat box. Um, uh, please open that up. We're going to start off with Amparo over on the uh, left hand side. And Amparo, let me have you read uh, from uh, Kelly Loves School. Down to, let's see, go ahead and finish that, that first paragraph, okay? Okay. Kelly loves school, especially Jean class. She is a very good student and enjoys reading and math. But Kelly has a hard time in Jean class. She's not good at jumping very far. And she can not really run really fast. Sometimes the other kids in the in her gene class give her a hard time and make fun of her. So why would uh, would Kelly love gene class? Okay, very good. Let's uh, check out the word would. Yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> would. All right, one more time. Wo would. Would. Okay, good. All right, let's uh, let's go to the word uh, words at jumping. So, um, okay, so working at looking good. at good, good at jumping. Good at jumping. Okay, one more time. Good at jumping. Good at jumping. <clears throat> okay. There you go. Yeah. Uh, everything else was uh, was just fine. Okay. Nice job. Nice job. Okay. Let's go to uh, Fausto. 
And yes, teacher. Also, let me have you read uh, from uh, her teacher. Her teacher down to. Um, let's see how many is that. Yeah, we'll go to we'll go to longer. Okay, so what are we looking for here in in uh, in uh, in the reading, Fausto? We're watching for W sounds, right? Yes, teacher. <laughs> w sounds, and uh, we're also going to watch for Y sounds. Remember, instead of Ju, we're going to say E U, right? Okay. Okay. All right, man. Go for it. Okay. Perfect. Her teacher, Mr. Barnes, know that Kelly has a hard time doing certain activities in his class. The reason Kelly enjoys going to the gym, to gym, sorry, class is because Mr. Burns always tells her to do her best, even if she only runs for a few minutes. Mr. Burns say, "Good job. Next time you will will be able to go a little longer." Okay, very good. All right, so you nailed the W here. Okay, but we have you instead of you will. Okay, you, you will. Okay, you will. There you go. Okay, now, our next point of attack. All right, our next point of attack, Fausto, is going to be the short I sounds. All right, and I know right now Amparo is going, ugh, short I. Right? <laughs> okay, short I sounds. These are, these are uh, probably going to be even uh, uh, trickier than, uh, than the W and the, and the U. Okay, uh, because uh, when your mind, when you see those eyes, you're immediately thinking e. Okay, you want to say little, li. Okay, you're gonna have to push against that, especially with words that look like Spanish words, like minutes. Okay, it's very close to minutos, right? So you want to say that, but you're gonna have to push against that, and instead of saying an e sound, you want to say i. Okay? okay, so let's try this out. Okay, instead of little, we're going to say li, little. Okay, little. Okay, one more time, little. Little. Good. All right, how about minutes? Minutes. Good, nice job. Okay, um, instead of mister, mister Burns, mister, mister Burns. Mister. Good, good. Okay, and, all right, here's a tricky one as well. So instead of uh, activities... Acti activities, activities. Okay, activities. There you go, good. All right, now, you can definitely pronounce those. Okay, it's not too difficult for you, but just like the Ys and the, uh, and the W sounds, you have to focus in on them. Okay, nice job. Okay, teacher, thank you. All righty, let's go to Giovanni. Yes, teacher. Um, Giovanni, let me have you read from Mr. Burns, okay, even put, uh, put a small box, and I'll have you read down to, let's see, um, three boxes in the class, please. Okay. Mr. Burns even put a small box on the gym floor so Kelly would be able to practice jumping over it. Great job, Kelly. You get better every day. That night... When Kelly finished dinner, she went to her room and placed some small boxes in a row and began practicing jumping over them. She was able to jump over three boxes. Kelly thought to herself, tomorrow in gym class I will be able to jump over th those boxes. And sure enough, Kelly did jump over three boxes in class. Okay, nice job. Let's uh, let's take a look here at the word three. This is a tricky one with that th and the r. Okay, so force your tongue down. Okay, that's what you want to do instead of saying three. Okay, thir, three. Three. There, that's it. Nice job. So over three boxes. Try that. Over three boxes. Okay, give me a good th instead of tree. Three over three boxes. Over three boxes. That's it. Nice job, man. Very good. Okay. Uh, let's do the short I sound on the word did instead of deed, did. Did. Good. Okay. Um, this word here, let's see. 
began, okay? Uh, this word here, instead of began, bega, it is began. Began. Mm -hmm, very good. Uh, next word is dinner, okay? Short I sound instead of diner, dinner. Dinner. Excellent. Okay, good short I. Next word is the word you. Instead of you get better, you. You get better. You get better. Okay, good. Nice job with better as well. Very good R sounds. Okay, and let's go to the word would. Uh, trying to pronounce a D at the end of the word. Instead of a Spanish D saying would, okay, it is would. Would. Good. Nice job. Okay, very good. Yeah, same same thing with you. You can definitely pronounce those sounds. Okay, just focus in on those and, and keep trying, keep remembering, making notes and, and, and getting those sounds, getting your tongue to follow what your mind is telling it to do. Okay, very okay. good job, Giovanni. Thank nice. you. Nice. All right, let's go to uh, Julian. Yeah. Okay, Julian, let me have you read... Uh, three boxes in class, I believe. Uh, so, the other kids, okay? The other kids started to see. And I'll have you read down to... Um, okay, uh, go Kelly, you can do it, please. Okay. The other kids started to see how well Kelly was doing and said to her, Good job. It was Tuesday and time for the Wico Relay race in gym class. Kelly was, was scared that she would not, not be able to go very far, or some kids would la laugh, at, laugh at her. But when Mr. Burns, Mr. Burns said, ready, said, go, Kelly thought to herself, I can do it, I can do it. As Kelly ran around the track, she found herself moving closer and closer into first place. All of a sudden, she, hear, she heard many cheers and kids yelling. Go, Kelly, you can do it. Okay, nice job. All right, very good. Let's, uh, let's go to the word you. Instead of uh, go, Kelly, you can do it. Okay, yeah. you, you can do it. You can do it. There you go, nice job. Okay, uh, this word, uh, yes, without the D, okay, that would be here. Okay, this word is heard. Heard. Okay, yeah, with that D on there, it's an er sound. So one more time, heard. Heard. Okay, very good. All right, let's go to, uh, let's see, um, the word said, okay? Instead of said, using a long A sound here, um, when, uh, when the verb to say is in past tense, it switches to a short E sound. The word is said. Said. Good, nice job. All right, now, um, here's, here's the difference. So um, we have the word said and set. Okay, now, this is, this is why uh, being able to pronounce that D and the T and have them sound differently uh, would be important. Okay, if you say uh, a T at the end, that word then sounds like set. Okay, instead of said, saying said, set. Okay, so um, let's try and get a difference there between the D and the T. So let's try this. We're going to try for that D. We're going to say said. Said. Okay, almost, almost. Okay, let's uh, let's do the sound. We're going to say D, D, Ed, D, Dead. Said. Said. Okay. All right. I can tell you're thinking of the R. You're thinking of the R, and you're trying. You're trying to um, throw it in there. Okay. Almost there. So let's uh, let's try this. We're gonna say um, um, uh, just the D sound. Okay. So d d d dead dead dead. D d d. <laughs> it's uh -huh. so difficult. Yeah. <laughs> keep going. D d d dead 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 dead. Okay, almost. All right, so that that's a, an, another practice you can use. So work on saying de, 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 dead, dead, okay, and working to where you're saying the word dead. So starting with a D and ending with a D. Your tongue is going to go straight up and down, okay? You don't want it to move forward, but only straight up and down, okay? Okay. All right, nice job. Good work. Okay, thank you. All righty, let's go to Laszlo. Yes, teacher. 
and we went to you can do it. So, um, last little, please read from uh, uh, that was all she needed to hear. Okay, uh, down to uh, let's see, um, her. Yep, yeah, made fun of her, please. Okay, that was all she needed to her. Kelly ran around the track as fast she could and headed for the finish line. She made it. Kelly finished first. The kids clapped and cheered her uh, for her. Kelly felt so good and proud of herself. Thank you, Mr. Barnes, said Kelly. Kelly, you run the race, not me. Yes, but you always said e I could do it. After that day, Kelly tried for uh, her hardest at every everything, and the kids no longer laughed or made fun or of her. Okay, good. All right, let's go to the word laughed. This word here is laughed. Laughed. Okay, good. Nice job. Okay, uh, let's go to. Uh, let's go to the word proud. This word here is proud. Proud. Okay, good. All right, uh, here instead of felt, this is fell, yeah, felt. Felt, felt. Okay, good. All right, here, uh, let's practice that uh, double, uh, the double E, that long E, into the ED ending. So, cheered, cheered. Cheered. Good, nice job. Okay. Uh, let's go to the word headed. Short E instead of heated. This is headed. Headed. Okay, excellent. And uh, last one is going to be uh, here. Okay, right here. The word is here. Here. Okay, very good. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, let's go to Olga. Yes. Uh, Olga Danilkina. Um, let's see here. I'm going to come back just a ways so that we can finish up this story. Uh, but I'll have you start off where uh, it says, Kelly felt so good. Uh, and read down to the end, please. Okay. In fact, when she, when she kids needed someone on their teams for jumping or running, Kelly was the first person uh, they picked. Uh, picked. Uh, she will always remember Mr. Burns and uh, the kid, you know, kid words uh, he said to her. Thanks to Mr. Burns, Kelly had the confidence and she needed, she needed to do anything. Okay, all right, very good job. Uh, let's go to the word confidence instead of confidence, confidence. Mm -hmm. Confidence. Good, nice job. Okay, uh, this this name is Kelly. Kel, Kelly. Kelly, Kelly. Okay, instead of Kelly, okay, end with an e sound. Kelly, Kelly. Ke Kelly. There you go. One more time, Kelly. Kelly. Excellent. Okay, uh, this word is pronounced her, her. Her. Okay, good. One more time. Give me more of an er at the end. Her. 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 Good, good. Much better. Okay. Uh, this word is pronounced kind instead of kind. Kind uh, words. Uh, sorry. Uh, kind. Good. One more time. Kind. Kind. Good. And let's go to um, first person. Okay. Fur. First. First person. Fur, first person. Okay, good. One more time. First person. First person. Okay, excellent. And let me check. I think that was my last one. Yep, it was. Okay, very good. Thank you, Olga. Thank you, teacher. All right, let's go to our next story. And this is uh, The Lonely Goldfish. All right, the link is in the chat box. Go ahead and open that up, you guys. And Olga Rios, you'll uh, read next, please. Okay. All right. All right, so Olga, let me have you uh, read through this first paragraph, and then 
a couple lines in this next one. I'll have you read down to uh, Asked Mom, please. Sam has a goldfish. He keeps his goldfish in a small bowl next to his bed. Sam is careful not to overfeed his goldfish and makes, and makes sure he has clean water and is happy. One day, Sam said to his mom, I don't think Tinker is very happy. What do you say, Dad? Asked Mom. Okay, very good. Uh, so, so instead of what do you say that, it is why. Why Mom, do you say that? Why do you say that? Sorry. Okay, why very you... good. Okay, let's practice the word that. Give me a, uh, a voiced TH. That. That. Okay. That. Uh, almost, you're saying that using a D sound, okay? Voice TH. Th that. 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 There, that's the TH. Okay, good. All right. Can't trick my ears. I can hear it. I can hear it. Um, <laughs> very good. Let's go to uh, overfeed. Okay, instead of overfed, overfeed. 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 Good, nice, nice job. Okay, and last one is key, keeps. 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 Excellent. Excellent. Nice job. All right. Thank you, Olga. Thank you. All righty. Let's see here. Let's go to uh, Stephen. Okay. All right. Stephen, please read from Sam told his mom. Um, down to uh, Tinker. Okay. Uh, goldfish friend for Tinker, please. Okay. Um, Sam told his mom that... Tinker has w no one to swim with, um, with, and that he sometimes just sits behind his toy tree uh, in his bone. Uh, do you think Tinker uh, would be happy? Would be happy to have another fish to swim with him? Ask, asked his mom. Yes, cried Sam. That w would be great. The next day after Sam came home from school, he and his mom went to went to the pet shop, the pet store, to buy another goldfish friend for Tinker. Okay, very good. All right, let's take a look here at the word goldfish. Okay, uh, two things on this word. Uh, you ended the word with a T saying goldfish, okay, and with that SH sound, okay, and instead of saying goldfish, putting the stress at the end of the word, stress goes at the beginning, goldfish. Try that. Okay, goldfish. Mm -hmm. Very good. Let's see. Okay, uh, let's go to the word mom. Instead of mum, mum. Okay, it's an ah sound. Ma, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, one more time. Mom. Mom. There you go. Good. Uh, this ne next word is the word bowl. Okay, instead of bowl, it is bow, bowl. Bowl. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, very good. Um, next up, we have the word tree give me a chr sound here tr tree tree good one more time tr tree tree okay good good and uh, last word is the word swim instead of swim okay uh, use a short i sound swim okay swim good nice job all right thank you steven thanks All right, let's see. Let's go to Amparo. And Amparo, let me have you read from the store had only three goldfish. Uh, finish this uh, paragraph. And oh, that's a long paragraph. That's a long mm -hmm. sentence. Um, okay, yeah, go ahead and, uh, and read down to just the end of the paragraph, please. The store had only three goldfish, goldfish left. Um, Sam could not decide which one he wanted to take home. He thought and thought, but could not pick a friend for Tinker. Finally, Mom said to the man at the back store, We'll take all three. Whoa, he yells. 
stand. That would be great. Tinker will not be lonely anymore. Okay, very good. Uh, only two words for you. Um, this word, instead of woe, it's wow. Wow. <laughs> okay, woe. Woe is close. It's W W H O A. Okay, that would be woe. Okay. Okay, wow is W O W. Okay. Okay. All right, let's go to. Um, okay, uh, felt. Uh, where did you go? Uh oh, I lost felt. Is it even in there? Which I swear. one? Swear. Uh, the word felt. Why did I write down felt? Left. I may have. <laughs> <laughs> I think my my dyslexia is kicking in. Yes. Okay, left instead of instead of felt. Left. Left. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Holy cow. Dyslexia, you guys, is when you get your words uh, mixed mixed around. Or, your, sorry, your letters mixed around. And, uh, yes, uh, very good. <laughs> like, why did I write down felt? Very funny. Yeah, I don't remember. I, I read that. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Oh, man, I love it. Okay, very good. Thank you very much, Amparo. Oh, uh, wow. Okay, Fausto. All right, yes. Fausto, you get a you get a big one because we've only got here uh, one, two. Okay. This is for four. Ah, it's five sentences total. So go ahead and read that last paragraph for me, okay? Okay, teacher. Um, here we go. Because Sam and his mom bought three fish, they had to buy a bigger bowl so the fish would have plenty of room to swim and they even bought another toy for the new family of fish. When Sam got home and put all the fish together in their new bowl, Thinker started swimming so fast. Sam knew Thinker was now a, hi a happy fish and no longer lonely. He spent the night thinking of three names for his new fish and watch them all get along while they sat on his bed. Sam was not lonely either. Okay, very good. All right, so let's uh, let's try out was not. Okay, so looking at that T sound, all right, uh, even with the, uh, the uh, English T, we don't touch our tongue to the back of our teeth like the uh, Spanish T. Okay, so this is a hard T sound. It is was not, was not. Try that. Okay, uh, was not. Okay, all right. Watch your W. Ooh, was not. Okay, was not. Good. Much better with that T sound. Very good. Okay, uh, let's go to the word watched. Okay, watch that W on here. Okay, so instead of watched, ooh, okay, watched, watched. Good. Nice job. Okay, um, now um, the word happy. Okay, um, the difference here with the H. The H in English is like a, sh it's just small breath. It's very, very light. Okay? okay, you're really pushing into it like a J sound saying happy. Okay, but the H is light. It's like a breath. Like, okay, very, very light. Happy. Just like that. Happy. Happy. Okay, a little lighter. Okay, come back off it just a bit. Happy. Happy. Yep, just like that. Okay, so the H's are really, really light in in, uh, in English. Okay, just like that. Okay. Um, all right. So this word here, you were saying thinker. Okay. This is a hard T sound. It is T tinker. Tinker. Good. Nice job. Okay. Um, next word is the the word have. All right. So uh, right here, a V sound here. Have. Have. Good. Much better with the V. Okay. And uh, this word is pronounced bot. Instead of bout, it is ba. Bot. Bot. Okay. The G is silent. Okay. The word is ba. Ba. T. Bot. Okay. Bot. Good. Good. And last word is the word bowl. 
Okay, an O sound. Bo -u. Bowl. 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 Good, good. Nice job. All right, thank you very much. Thank you. All right, let's go to our next story, you guys. This is uh, We Want a Pet. Okay, the uh, link is in the chat box. Please open that up. And let's go to uh, Giovanni. Yes, teacher. All right, Giovanni, let me have you read uh, from the beginning here, uh, Rachel and Renee, uh, down to the bottom of this paragraph, please. Okay. Rachel and Renee are nine-year-old twins. However, they do not look identical. Rachel has brown hair and brown eyes, while Renee has blonde hair and blue eyes. For the longest time, the twins were beginning their mom to have a pet. Their choices for a pet were as different as they were. Okay, very good job. Let's check out some words. Uh, first up, this word, uh, you had said begging. The word is begging. 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 Good, nice job. All right, uh, next word is identical. 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 Good. One more time. Identical. Identical. Okay. Very good. And last word is the word year instead of jeer. Okay. This is nine-year-old twins. Nine-year-old twins. Nine-year-old nine twins. There you go. One more time. Nine-year-old twins. Nine-year-old twins. Uh. <laughs> Nine-year-old right. twins. There you go. Nice job. Okay. Thank you, Giovanni. Thank you, teacher. All righty. Let's see here. Let's go to uh, Julian. Yeah. All right, Julian, please read from This Is Where the Problem Began. And I'll have you read down to um, Around on His Wheel, please. Let's see. Is that – actually, that's only two – that's three sentences. Let me get uh, – Fourth. So read down to uh, care for that pet, please. Okay. This is where the problem began, Rachel, w Rachel would say. A dog is a better pet than a hamster because you can teach a dog tricks and run in the, and run in the park with him. Rene would say, a hamster would make the best pet because we wouldn't have to walk the hamster and we could sit and watch him run, run around on his wheel. Mom said they needed to sit down together and make a list of each pet they talk, talked about and how they would care for, for, the pet, for that pet. Okay, all right, nice job. Very good pronunciations. Um, uh, now, uh, the word I want to look at is wouldn't. Okay, here you had said woo, wouldn't. All right, but down here you pronounced it correctly, saying would, would care. All right, so let's try this one up here. We're going to say wo, wouldn't. Wouldn't. Okay, give me a T at the end. Wouldn't. Wouldn't. Good, nice job. Okay, and let's go to the word dog. This word is da, dog. Dog. Okay. All right. Give me that G at the end. Here you're pronouncing a K, saying saying doc. Okay. It is g like goal. Okay. Goal. We want to say dog. 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 <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Now um, uh, speed that up just a little bit. Okay. And and uh, try not to hold on to that G. Okay. So nice and quick. Okay. Dog. Dog. Okay, almost. Okay, go back, and we're going to uh, slow it down. Dog. Dog. Good. One more time. Dog. Dog. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, it almost feels like you're swallowing your tongue. <laughs> okay? Uh, and that's that's almost what you're doing, right? Okay, one more time. We're going to say dog. Dog. Okay, good. Much better. Okay, so that's that G sound. All right. Now, the idea... 
Okay, right now it's like um, it's like when you go to when you go to the gym. I don't know if you go to the gym and lift weights or not or uh, anything, but really the idea with with muscles and that's what your tongue, your brain, your mouth, uh, all that. It sh it just works with muscles, right? So when you first go, you're not going to be able to lift a whole bunch of weight. Okay, and and uh, if you start uh, start lifting weight and you don't have the right form. Okay, so if you're really swinging your back and you're trying to do curls where you lift up the bar with your arms, okay, if you're swinging your back, you're going to hurt your back and you're not going to be able to lift right and, it, and really it'll affect your muscles, okay. Now here, the point is, it's not going to sound as pretty as how I say it right now, but if you get your tongue in the right position, okay, and you practice it over and over again, Okay, it, the muscles will remember that, and since it's in the right position, then you'll be able to work on the tone and the sound. Okay, as long as the, your tongue is there. So, yeah, you might hold on to that G just a little longer. That's okay. But if your if your tongue is there and you're pronouncing that G sound, okay, that's the place you want to start off, start at, and then you can start to tailor it from there. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. Yeah. Keep keep working on it though. Okay. Nice job. Uh, let's go to Laszlo. Yes. All right. Last though, I believe we went to okay. So pet. So let's see. Let's go from a pet is a lot of responsibility um, down to. Um, let's go to buy their. Yep, buy their pet, please. Okay. A pet is a lot of responsibility," said Mom. Someone has to make sure there is always food and water. Water. The girls agreed and sat down that night to make their list. After school the next day, they went to Mr. Riley R Riley's pet sh shop and asked Mr. Riley to see some pup puppies and hamsters. Uh, they girls were going to have to spend the money they sa saved from birthday and Christmas together to buy their pet. Okay, nice job. All right, let's go to the word birthdays. 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 Good, one more time. Birthdays. Birthdays. Okay, and let's try Cur Chris, Christmas. Christmas. Okay, one more time. Christmas. Christmas. Very good. Okay. Um, all right. Let's go to uh, the girls agreed. The girls agreed. The girls agreed. Okay, one more time. Working on that GR sound. The girls agreed. The girls agreed. Okay, good. Um, now, the first time you said the word, you were correct on it. The word is water. 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 All right, very good. And last word is responsibility. Responsibility. Uh, response. Uh, responsibility. Okay, excellent. All right, nice job. Thank you, Laszlo. Thank you, Chad. All righty, let's see here. Let's go to Olga Danilkina. Yes, yes. Okay, uh, please from uh, Mr. Riley. And I'll have you read down till... Um, um, Mr. Riley was so surprised, okay? Okay. Mr. Riley showed them a cut uh, brown, uh, brown beagle puppy and a white poodle. He also showed them a brown and white, white hamster. The girls bought the list they, they made the night before and asked Mr. Riley many questions on how to car to care for each pet. Finally, the girl said, Mr. Riley, we have made our discussion. We will take that cut uh, white bunny with the uh, adorable pink nose. Mr. Riley was so surprised. Okay, very good. <clears throat> All right, let's uh, work on the D sound on this last word instead of surprised. It is surprised. Surprised. Good, good. Nice job. 
All right, let's go to the word uh, cute. This word here instead of uh, cut, Q, cute, 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 cute. All right, nice mm -hmm. job. Okay, uh, this word instead of discussion, the word is decision. Oh, sorry, decision. <laughs> okay, decision. no worries. All right, very good. Okay, uh, this word is pronounced care. Give me a good R there at the end. Care. Care. Good. One more time. Care. Care. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. And this word here is pronounced brr, bra, brought. Brought. Good. One more time. Brought. Brought. All right, nice job. Okay, very good. Uh, thank you. Let's go to Olga Rios. Thank you. All right, Olga, let me have you read uh, from How Did You Decide uh, down to um, down to, uh, pick to picked out for him, please. Um, how did you decide on a rabbit? We bark like rabbits. And he looks so sad, and we know he is waiting for someone to take him and love him. With both, with both of us, he will get double the love. Mister really got the rabbit, the cake, and some straw for them to make sure they had everything they would need to care for for the rabbit. Do you have a name picked picked out for him? Okay, very good. All right, let's uh, let's try some uh, th sounds. Okay, uh, okay. so here we have uh, they. They, they, they. Okay, we have the. The. And everything. Everything. Good. Okay, so uh, let's go from uh, here down to the end of the sentence. They had everything they would need to care for the rabbit. Try that. They have everything they will need to care for the rabbit. Okay, for the the rabbit. For the, for the rabbit. There you go. Nice job. Okay. Uh, let's go to the word sad. Um, he looks okay here. Okay, sad. Instead of said, it is sa sad. 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 Good. All right, give me a D sound there at the end instead of sat. It is sad. 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 Okay, good, good, nice job. And last word is decide. 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 Okay, good. Nice job. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, and Stephen, let me have you read um, this uh, last part here on the story. So from Rachel said... Down to come true, please. Okay. Rachel said, we are going to, to call him double trouble because of us being twins. Mr. Relaine laughed and the girls carry uh, double trouble to his, to his new uh, home where he would, he would be taken good good care of all and giving lots of love. They said and they set up his cage in the gar uh, garage garage um, checked on him to be sure he was happy and played with him often. Their dreams of getting a pet had fin finally come true. Okay, very good. Now, uh, here at the end, instead of dreams, this would be dream. Their dream of getting a pet. Mm -hmm. Dream of getting a pet. Try that. Okay. Their, dre uh, their dream getting of getting a pet. Okay, nice job. Uh, this word here is pronounced happy with an ah sound instead of happy, he. It is ha, happy. Okay. Happy. Good, one more time. Happy. Happy. Excellent. Okay, let's go to the word garage. This word is garage. Garage. Okay, very good. All right, let's see. Oops. Okay, next word is the word given. Instead of gi given, 
given, it is give, given. Okay. Giving. Okay, one more time. Given. Giving. Okay, very good. Um, this word is pronounced carried. Carried. Okay. Carried. Okay, very good. Um, let's see. Uh, this here is the word laughed. Uh, let's Where'd you go? Okay, right here. Uh, this is laughed. Laughed. Okay, one more time. Laughed. Laughed. Okay, very good. All right, thank you very much, Stephen. Okay, thanks. Okay, let's go back to the to the top here to uh, Amparo, and we're going to go to our next story, you guys. Okay, um, this is entitled "The Surprise Visitor." Okay, this is in the chat box. Please open that up. All right, and I'll have Amparo read. He'll start off for us. Uh, go ahead and read this uh, first paragraph, okay? Okay. It was early spring, and Toby and his little sister Kate were excitedly looking forward to their vacation break from school. Only two more days, thought Toby, and I will be able to have some fun in the sunny, warm weather. It had been it had been a long, cold winter, and Toby wanted to be outside. Okay, very good. Let's take a look at two words here. Uh, first up, we have the word looking instead of lo looking. Looking. Okay, yeah. Lo yeah. looking. Looking. Okay, and uh, last one is little instead of little, little. Little. Good, nice job. All right, thank you very much. Okay, let's go to uh, Fausto. Yes. All right, Fausto, please read from Toby suddenly uh, down to um, uh, and tell him his idea, please. Okay. Um, Toby suddenly had an idea that he wanted to go camping over the weekend to celebrate the start of a spring break. What better way to enjoy the outdoors than to go camping? Toby ran into the house to find his dad and tell him his idea. That doubt it was great idea too. Okay, good, good, nice job. Um, let's go to uh, the word thought. Instead of thought, it is thought. Mm -hmm. Thought. Okay, good, good. Um, nice job with your short eyes sounds here. Uh, the only one that I uh, that I heard was the word into. Okay, so instead of in into, it's in into. Into. Okay, one more time. Give me a short I in into. Into. Okay, good. Uh, let's go to the word better instead of better bed. Think of a, an R sound here. Better. Better. Okay, very good. And that's, yep, that's all I had. Uh, good job with your W sounds. Okay. okay. Um, really good job. No W uh, errors or anything like that. Those sounded really nice. Okay. Okay, finally. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Uh, good. Uh, let's go to my next reader. Uh, this is Giovanni. Yes. Giovanni, please read from If You Kids Want. Okay, down to, uh, let's see, hopefully, please. Okay. If you kids want, we can go to the quiet lake. Kate started jumping up and down with excitement because the last time she went to the quiet lake, she caught her first fish. Maybe I'll catch another fish, Kate says. Kate said, hopefully. Awesome. Nice correction there on said. Okay. Uh, the uh, the only word here, started. Okay. Your ED ending was good, but here you said, eh, started. So Kate started. Let's try that. Kate started. Kate started. Good. Okay. Nice job. 
And again, a uh, nice, nice correction with that, with that word. Okay. You, Very good. You. Thank you, Giovanni. Let's go to um, Julian. Yeah. All right. And it's caught our first fish. Uh, said hopefully. Okay. So let me have you uh, read from. Well, you, uh, you two better go out. Okay. And I'll have you uh, finish up the paragraph. So well down to pass by quickly, please. Okay. Well, you two better go out to the shed and, and start finding our supplies and don't forget the, the tent, said that. Kate and Toby went to the dusty shed out back and found the fishing poles, the tent and the, and the cooking supplies they would need. Now, all they needed wa was for the next two days of school to pass by quickly. Hello? Sorry, I muted myself when I thought I was muted. Okay, uh, here, um, uh, this word here is need. Okay, looking at the double E. Okay, this is a long E sound. The word is E, knee, need. Need. Okay, one more time. Need. Need. Okay, good, good. Let's go to the word um, tent. So uh, focusing on those T sounds. Tent. Tent. Good. Much better with your T sounds. Really good job. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Last one is the word supplies. Instead of supplies, supplies. Supplies. Okay, uh, with the Z sound there at the end, supplies. Supplies. Okay, S at the beginning, Z at the end. Supplies. Supplies. There, that's it. Okay, good. <laughs> okay. okay, that's the Z sound. Nice job, man. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, good. Uh, very good. All right, let's go to our last paragraph. This is for Laszlo. Yes. Uh, go ahead and read this last one, please. Okay. It was finally Friday, and that night at dinner, Dad said, "You kids need to get to bed early." Dad wanted to start for the lake around seven o'clock. Toby and Kate were so excited they could hardly sleep. Finally, the loud beeping sound of the alarm clock woke. Toby. All right. He, All right. Just tell there. Just tell there. Good. Good. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. It uh, actually goes on and on. I think this is one of the. This is like a two pager. Okay. So um, let's go to uh, woke. Okay. This word here is pronounced woke. Woke. Good. Okay. Uh, this uh, this word here uh, is pronounced loud instead of load. Loud. 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 Good, good. Uh, let's go to the word hardly. Okay, hardly. R sound there. Yeah, one hardly. more time. Hardly. Good, good. Okay. And last word here, I want to practice the word dinner. Instead of dinner, dinner. Dinner. All right, excellent. Okay, you guys, uh, thank you for thank you. Uh, for sticking around. It is uh, getting late for me, and I need to hit the sack. All right, thank you, thank you guys for uh, for coming into class. Really good job, really good work on on your reading. Uh, keep uh, keep progressing, keep improving, keep practicing, and uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, all right, see thanks guys. Teacher. See ya. Bye. 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 Bye.